Do you think porn is shaping people's idea of sex, consent, and even pleasure? Yes. <laughs> a lot. For sure. I think people don't realize how much influence porn has on just yeah. every day. There's a heavy emphasis on making the guy finish and not really the girl. Uh, I've noticed that some of my mates, the way they talk about women and it just it kind of you can see that it affects them. There's this idea among guys that they should be really possessive. That's just the really cool thing and women should be submissive and that is unbelievably common. <laughs> it's just not realistic and especially for like, if it's the guy's first time doing anything, he's gonna have such a different view. They kind of also take it as if a woman isn't screaming, it yeah. means she isn't enjoying herself. Yeah. Cause if you're watching it too much and it becomes an addiction, you're pretty much might change the way that you see how sex actually it is. Finish this sentence. If you or your sexual partners had never seen porn, sex would be? Like, it'd be experimental. And I think it'd be a bit more authentic because like the last person I was dating, mm. like, I don't know if he thought we were actually on Pornhub because like some of the Ooh. shit was doing, just like in his head, trying to like yeah. replicate what he had seen rather than like acting. Mm. I'm like, yeah. oh, I don't know what you're doing your spare time on your laptop, it's not but me. this I'm is real life. <laughs> this is real life. I reckon there'd be more of a conversation about it because there's nothing you could relate it to. So you probably like, ask around, see, see what's happening. Especially like close friends, you just like talk about it more, I reckon. You can see how it's quite different. Some of them can be good actors, but it's not a magical experience and like no one's screaming, I guess. You don't learn about how to have sex from porn. You learn about it from experimenting or talking to friends or even just researching online from reliable sources. Have you ever felt pressure to perform something you or your partner has seen in porn? What's it called where they tie something around them and wank off? Oh, no, 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 no. That. that. So I had a junior partner that was obsessed with that. Like that was quite triggering. Like, yeah. A friend of mine, she was dating this guy and he was like really into trying to dominate her. And I was like, well, maybe you should either like break up with him or talk to him and say you don't like it. Porn has really made girls feel pressured into being a certain way. It like shows them what they think they have to be for their partner. You get the whole, well, why won't you do this? I've seen it in pornos. Why can't you fulfill this pleasure for me? And it's like people not being able to separate the fact that porn isn't reality. I have been asked if I can do a split on the dick. <laughs> I'm like, like the logistics of that actually happening. <laughs> yeah. I, even like I gotta do my stretches. Like, what so the hell is that? Like, yeah. stretch. Whoop. Yeah. Uh, whoop. I'm like, that doesn't make sense. How do you think porn has influenced you or others around you in real life? <laughs> I think people who might consume porn in a relationship sometimes struggle with understanding boundaries as much. I also heard that um, a lot of positions in porn are not comfortable in real life and I think if you try them out they're probably gonna hurt either you or the other person. There was this guy that I slept with and he was choking me so hard. <laughs> I was like, where did you learn that from me? Chill, bro, no, straight up. We went to an old boys school, so. Yeah. It's crazy things you hear about porn, so yeah. <laughs> people come up to you, oh, did you see this? Yeah, there are like these expectations to be like, this f machine, and it's like, bro, like, it's chill. That's like, it's, it's literally chill. It's a bit toxic when you're younger, I think. There's probably some things that you see on porn that you think, oh, that looks like so much fun, and then you try it, and it's just... And it's like, what the f*** is this? <laughs> it's like, why did I even think that was a good idea? The more knowledge you have around things in life, like sexuality, pornography, sexual health, and stuff like, you know what's up. How do you think porn portrays women and men differently? How it's, like women are objectified and then yeah. made sexual objects and then when you put two together like that's hot. It degrades women so yeah. much. That's not how real life should be. The men in the porn are portrayed as like the bigger and stronger ones and also more important. The, the end goal is for him to finish. Men are often portrayed as masculine, dominant, fierce. Porn is just very different for women than it is for men. Yeah. Yeah, men see it as like, time. this is what I want, and then women are just like, no, yeah. not what I want. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Women are kind of portrayed as just like, this object is this vessel of false sexuality. There's never really a lot of talk about consent in porn. There's never a scene going, you cool with this? 
Yeah, I'm cool with this, you cool with this? Yeah, I'm cool with that. Cool, though. It's just kind of like... How is porn sex different from real life sex? Stamina. <laughs> Stamina. Yes! Porn is staged, obviously. It's a film that's perfectly curated to look pleasurable for that audience. A person who has seen a lot of porn before uh, might have bad ideas about how to have sex. They might be doing things that are uncomfortable. I know a lot of people struggle to get off after they've watched a lot of porn because sex isn't like porn. Being yes. able to come. Yes! <laughs> Um, the amount of times that we've just given up. You know what, it's just, we're tired. <laughs> yeah. Real sex is like more of a bonding experience or between two partners. It's about connecting. So they think, oh, they have to be big and muscular, or they have to be big downstairs in the way they think they look, but it might affect how you know, teenagers might see other people. It's fantasy sex. <laughs> they never sex. tell you that the girl gets tired too. Porn sex is not real. Porn sex is not real. How would you describe porn to someone who had never seen it before? Uh, porn is videos of people having sex. You know how like when mummy and daddy <laughs> love each other very much and they do the special hug, <laughs> this so yeah. there'll be another person filming. <laughs> and doing sexy things to make the viewer horny. But usually if you go on a porn site, it's just mostly a guy and a girl, you know. It's really orientated around that heterosexual type of feeling. So, like, I knew, like, this wasn't real. Porn was a facade. It was uh, for entertainment purposes, you know. I think it's like a pretty picture of what some people expect sex to be. And it's not like that most of the time. Having a non-realistic expectation of how you should be in the bedroom can bring insecurities to not only men, but also the women. So I think it can have a really deteriorating effect on self-esteem. I've never watched porn to get info on sex. Yeah, I have. I mean, I think everyone has. With my first partner, I got exposed to fetishes and I was like, oh, okay, so I want to learn about this. Like, what do people do? How do I do this? Yeah, so I guess I did use it for like research purposes. <laughs> I was pretty young when I saw my first porn star. I was like, whoa, what the hell is this <laughs> No ways is real. And then you get older, you learn stuff, and I was like, I knew what was going on. Don't watch it with the mindset that this is what sex is like. You don't learn about how to have sex from porn. You learn about it from experimenting or talking to friends. I think the first porn I watched, you know that like Spider-Man Vine thing where it like had like the rhythmic beat on that I don't know what this is. Well, then my first porn video was like actually looking up the full version of that. I and then know. yeah, so that so Spider-Man porn was my first. And that was great. Do you want this on the internet? Shooting webs has a whole new meaning. What do you think about porn? Love it. <laughs> it depends on what kind of porn. It's not real. It's just fake and all that stuff. I think um, it affects us in certain ways, doing like our weird stuff with other girls, but some girls might not like that. Only about 20% of women can have an orgasm from penetration alone. The fact that most porns are just like, he sticks it in one and done. Just because one person finished does not mean that sex is over. I will say, I can tell when I have sex with a man if he's watched a lot of porn. There was this guy that I slept with and he was choking me so hard. <laughs> I was like, where did you learn that from? Chill, you like, yeah. no, straight up. It depends on what you learn from it. Like when you start thinking that you have to actually replicate it for you to get off and like you to I mean, I think it's someone. just like the most popular porn categories at this point like really? pretty degrading to women that's not like healthy because people like have the expectation they need to like replicate that what has porn taught you about sex what happens on the internet is it's not real and that you shouldn't believe it literally the only thing i think about when i think about porn is just like aggression Pounding, like, you know? Porn is like really not realistic, and it's only taught me to make sure others know that. My experience with queer sex, it hasn't been what is portrayed actually like online. Graphic. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like made for the male gaze, and then it's no, just yeah. like lots of. Definitely like, the male oh, gaze. I've got to make the way he thinks it'll go down, uh, just makes me worried for whoever he might meet. I always try to tell him, like, you know, porn's not 
realistic and he definitely thinks that what he sees on the screen is what actually happens. Yeah, like yeah. I guess that would definitely affect young men like, oh, well, like I don't have a massive dick yeah. and yeah. so therefore I can't please my partner and so yeah. at yeah. the end of the day, we don't all have that. <laughs>What impact does porn have on body image? So porn is an unrealistic depiction of sex and through that unrealistic depiction they're depicting these perfect bodies when in reality every single person in the world has different bodies, different anatomy, different everything. Yeah, but even like just in terms of like genitalia, people like casted because of what it looks like. 99% yeah. of porn stars, like they're shaved, they're waxed, you know, fake titties, everything's in. So many young kids growing up look at it and are like, I don't look like that. Especially with their penises. Penises in porn are far too big compared to mine. <laughs> Imposing on people that they have to look a certain way to be sexually attractive and that might not make them competent to even be sexual mm. with other people or to even try. So they're just home alone jerking off. What is the most unrealistic thing about porn? I could say so many things right now. Your general porn video, it's just like, uh, The lack of communication and the bodies displayed. The lack of consent talk. I don't think I've ever seen a porn scene in which the man asks really, like clearly, and they have a conversation about consent. I'm cool with this, I'm cool with that, I'm cool with X, Y, Z. You don't really see that, it's kind of like, steps is, <laughs> some steps. All the women that were represented were like, showing this one body as an ideal is so damaging. Oh, I just think it's ridiculous because they don't understand that they can have great, healthy, communicative and loving sex without looking like that. Only about 20% of women can have an orgasm from penetration alone. The fact that most pawns are just like, he sticks it in one and done, he finishes, yeah. sex is finished. Just because one person finished does not mean that sex is over.